how Umnel Iman shines his part of faith. Where is the time when shamelessness used to be a much greater tragedy than loss of life? Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Wa alaikum assalam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Haya, misbashfulness, modesty, humility, and shyness. Every one of us as Muslims should have a sense of haya. We should affect our conduct before our Lord, before others, and even when you are alone. From the way that you carry yourself, everyone around you should know, yes, this is a Muslim sister or this is a Muslim brother. Not only from the way that you're dressed, but this haya in the way that you walk and this modesty in the way that you speak. This modesty should reflect on virtually everything that you do. Fatima, she was so modest that even at the time of her death, when she became ill and her death was imminent, she told us, Allah, she said, when the time comes to do my janaza, do it at night so that no one can see my figure. And when you bury me, bury me at night so they can't see my figure. Subhanallah, this was someone that was on their deathbed. But brothers and sisters, we no longer aspire to be like the Muslim women before us. We no longer aspire to be like the pious Muslims before us. We are so bored and tired of hearing the stories of the Sahabas and the Sahabiyats. Instead, sisters, we want to be like the skinny 21st century models we see on TV. We have them as our wallpapers. We have their pictures on our bedroom walls. We know everything about them. But what we don't know is that we're following blindly the tricks of Shaitan. This Iblis that promised to drag us to Jahannam with him, he dictates to us what to do and we follow him blindly. And yet when we are cautioned, we still say this is the 21st century. Let people live the way they want to. Let me tell you, civilization has no effect whatsoever on the Quran. If the Quran said we should cover during the time of the Rasul sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, it will still say the same thing in a million years to come. The words of the Quran won't change because of our so-called civilization. The words of Allah won't change because it's the change first century. This higher and trustworthiness, they're disappearing from the surface of this dunya like they never existed. A room full of people, but hardly a soul you can trust. This world is full of Muslims, but even from among us, only few hold this thing called haya. And when you are modest, when you do cover, when you do have this haya, you are criticized. You are seen as something strange, like those strange looks we all get when we enter a supermarket wearing a hijab. But don't be discouraged by these strange looks. Because the Prophet said, Islam started as something strange and it will go back to being something strange. So glad tidings to the strangers. If you are a stranger at this age, year and time, then be glad, be happy. This is what the Prophet was talking about. We were the people that the Prophet was talking about. Brothers and sisters, we should also remember that Haya is as important as in men as it is in women. After all, the most modest of this Ummah was a man. May Allah grant us Haya and restore Haya to this Ummah. Amen. And may he count us among the righteous and grant us the strength and ability to carry out the teachings of the Quran. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Wa alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.